We are 7324. So somewhere down here. Other way. <laughs> it's right here. I remember being like, oh, we're really close to the stairs and elevator, but it's also going to save us a lot of walking time by being close. And I get red lighted right, right away. Yes! MTV Cribs, come on in my crib. Okay. Definitely a little smaller, than the one on Symphony, yeah. but it'll do. There's a light switch. Um, there. Okay. Gold member perks right there. Nice. Fruit plate. <coughs> Not huge, but good enough. The light switch is over here. By the way. Do I need to put my card in to turn the lights on? I don't think so. Oh, okay. No, you okay. do not need a card. But perks of being a gold member is you get a little welcome uh, fruit plate, apparently. Yeah. Let's check out this balcony. This is what you pay for. Right. Oh, good. There is like a glass. Yeah. I was afraid it was going to come all the way up and be solid, but I'm glad that I can sit down and still see through there. Yeah. I was sure. really worried that it was going to be solid all the way to the the Norwegian, which one was it? Epic. So we are in room 7324, so it's deck 7. We're on the kind of the bump out of the ship and um, a balcony room as you can see behind me. We're just going to show you the size of the restroom really quick. Luke is about six feet six tall. Six feet tall, 180 pounds. It's kind of tight even for me on the toilet. Like, look at how his shoulders are, like, pretty it's much touching. Touching the wall, so, I mean, people might uh, struggle. But. Stand in the shower real quick. Shower. Oh, yeah. You got ample headroom in got there. Pretty good room, I mean. But our elbows will probably bump. Yeah. But it's not bad. Yeah. I would say the balcony room we were in on Symphony was a little bigger. Yeah. Obviously, it's a larger ship, too, but. Small couch area, bed, TV with um, storage in the desk, and some outlets. Two US ports there. Um, I think that's a European port. And then, oh, I have no idea what that thing is. Yeah, I don't know. Channel announcement on off. Yeah, we I haven't heard it. I don't know that it. I don't know. May but not I work. don't think there's any chargey by the bed, unless there's one in the phone. Sometimes there's. Oh yeah, there's a USB, USB in on the, the phone. phone. But I don't know if there's one for the passenger side. No, nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure the handle's down when you open the door. Yeah. Don't smash your finger and like I did. Yeah. I had this thing like pointed that way. And got ya. Got me. And then... We were kind of worried about how enclosed it feels compared to the other well, ships. Well, I thought it was going to be this solid stuff all the way up to here. So I'm glad we at least have that open yeah. space. But uh, yeah, it's nice. And you can see down the back side of the ship. 
here's what the privacy screen looks like between you and the next person. It's not um, super great, but it is there. Some of the lifeboats, so you, this is definitely not an obstructed view. Let's see everything just fine. Can't quite see the front of the ship. I like it. It's a good room. And we don't dis or we don't set sail until 8:30 tonight, so it'll be dark. The Super Bowl is today, so there's Super Bowl parties going on. I think the welcome aboard party starts in a couple of minutes. But I still haven't taken a tour of the ship. I want to find the water slides and the flow rider. We did go to the solarium already and visit the spa and the theater in Studio B. So maybe we'll take you on a hyperlapse tour. Yeah. Up next.